Hello and welcome to Geekit Play Studio Tutorials. So in this tutorial we're going to look how to make um, our plants stick to the objects. So you maybe saw a few screenshots how to do this and we'll look a little bit more on details. To do this first we needed to import the object that we want to interact our plant with. So we'll go file, import and we'll import the mesh. So right here I have an object. Notice it's created. We can reposition the object, but for now I can see my plant right here, so it's about on the middle. I think it's a good place to start it. Okay, right here we have our segment, we have our object where we can translate and put it all the scales. First thing, so what we want to do is inside the root. Okay, we need to go inside the global base and be sure object to grow in, it's selected. If you don't have it anything, it will be none. Or if you have it more than one, you may have a different one you want selected. Okay, next inside the segment, what I want to do, I want actually repeating this segment. So we're going to set a simple loop and I'm going to select the loop, set to 4 for now. We'll see if we need increasing. We'll take this segment and let's enable next. Okay, so right here you can see we have it, no interactions, just going inside. Now any segment in influence will it modify. Before I do this, let me add um, this one maybe 90% so we can see branches nicely and we'll set this one to 100 at least for now so you can see they kind of spread quite a bit out you know this preview now inside the influence we want to enable grow on an object so you can notice it's already start growing but it's create kind of straight lines okay let's work with the patch versions and we also look how they interact one let's go ahead and set this maybe to point two not high frequency but I want increased string and it's you remember what's happened it just randomly going in different directions so it's make a natural look okay, let's go five for this maybe five is a little bit too high Okay, let's go three for now. Okay, this is kind of start growing. Let's look on what we have at this moment. You notice first prune after and you have it link five. So what is meaning if, for example, some segments start growing up and it does not find any object that can go glue on or a torch in a five, it will stop growing. Let's set 25 as example. And you notice how we have it more growing now. It's add additional. So those options that cannot grow before, now they can find on top and they can start growing this way. Okay, dumping. This is interactions between string of the perversion and dumping. And depend on the values of this, you can see they will interact a little bit differently between each other. So for example, let's go on 10 and they'll go a little bit more closer to the parent and minus 10, it will more repel them kind of out so you can grow this way. Okay, as default, probably won't put it um, just slightly. So it's keeping, but it will keep closer our plan. Okay, so let's make look at this a little bit more interesting. So we'll go in the segment and to make more natural we can add 50 so it's plus minus 50 for this. Our radio about right except you know what let's do on an end shrinking a little bit so it will look more like a root. Okay well also let's fix our cups and 
Okay, and blending with parent enable. So right here, our segments will look a little bit more interesting. Okay, let's go now inside the influence. You know what? Um, maybe it's too much. Zero point zero five. Just set a little bit less. So we're kind of affecting. Okay, we'll go to you know, maybe 10. Let's see if it's 10 will work well. Okay, let's say you know, one. So we'll go a little bit higher so it's look nice. Okay, and on the repeater, you know what? Let's pop up this to six. So we'll have it much more going around okay right here we also can go in segments and we go to the next so we can kind of modify and um, see we'll go add 12 so we had much more segments going around okay it's take a little bit longer till it's producing lot of new branches okay till it's doing we also what I want to do is a little bit work on a coil so we'll go add right here and we'll go to the roll and maybe add the roll so we'll find at this point I think we're all set okay. Let's preview. Of course, if you modifying and you work a little bit more with the influence, how is effect or with the segment itself, you'll notice uh, some effect will go up. So in this case, you want to go inside the influence and you remember how I said we can use it attractor and other ones so you can go inside and let's switch this to the attractor so you'll notice how our um, pointing uh, sticks they will kind of going more towards the middle of this okay so you can see even with a not big amount of the repeaters we have a lot of, of the plant growing and right here, notice the attractor. This ends pointing to the point of regeneration. And currently, attractor is our main route. We also can go and influence. And other ones, of course, it's very interesting if you just create curl. It will just take these ends and kind of curl them around. You maybe want to pop up a little bit higher on this one. But let's create interesting also effect if you needed to add to this curl ending so it's kind of start bending with them yeah, so this is overview and the next um, step we'll go see in practical use in some of our project tutorials but for now this is how you can create a plant and make it attached to the object that you imported uh, it's also going to be some other tree maybe and uh, also how you can modify remember you can add leaves to create only ones or some rework a bit on the material for this. Thank you for watching this tutorial from Geek at Play Studio. Please remember visit us on the web is www.geekatplay.com.